When I was a child, there's one thing I said. I never want to be alone. That's what I would say. I don't want to be alone. Some people don't like change, but you need to embrace change if the alternative is disaster. I would like to die on Mars, just not on impact. I'm reasonably optimistic about the future, especially the future of the United States, for the century, at least. Land on Mars, a round trip ticket, half a million dollars, it can be done. When something is important enough, you do it even if the odds are not in your favor. Over time, I think we will probably see a closer merger of biological intelligence and digital intelligence. Rockets are cool. There's no getting around that. I think it would be great to be born on Earth and die on Mars, just hopefully not at the point of impact. Life is too short for long-term grudges. If something's important enough, you should try, even if the probable outcome is failure. Patience is a virtue, and I'm learning patience. It's a tough lesson. If you get up in the morning and think the future is going to be better, it is a bright day, otherwise it's not. If you're trying to create a company, it's like baking a cake. You have to have all the ingredients in the right proportion. I think it matters whether someone has a good heart. People work better when they know what the goal is and why. It is important that people look forward to coming to work in the morning and enjoy working. It's okay to have your eggs in one basket as long as you control what happens to that basket. Great companies are built on great products. People should pursue what they're passionate about. That will make them happier than pretty much anything else. To make an embarrassing admission, I like video games. That's what got me into software engineering when I was a kid. I wanted to make money so I could buy a better computer to play better video games. Nothing like saving the world. When I was in college, I wanted to be involved in things that would change the world. We're running the most dangerous experiment in history right now which is to see how much carbon dioxide the atmosphere can handle before there is an environmental catastrophe. Brand is just a perception, and perception will match reality over time. Sometimes it will be ahead, other times it will be behind. But brand is simply a collective impression some have about a product. Starting a business is not for everyone. Starting a business, I'd say, number one is have a high pain threshold. We're already cyborgs. Your phone and your computer are extensions of you, but the interface is through finger movements or speech, which are very slow. Any product that needs a manual to work is broken. It's very important to like the people you work with. Otherwise, your job is going to be quite miserable. I will never be happy without having someone. Going to sleep alone kills me. I don't create companies for the sake of creating companies, but to get things done. If we drive down the cost of transportation in space, we can do great things. We can't have, like, willy-nilly proliferation of fake news. That's crazy. You can't have more types of fake news than real news. That's allowing public deception to go unchecked. That's crazy. 
If I'm not in love, if I'm not with a long-term companion, I cannot be happy. When Henry Ford made cheap, reliable cars, people said, Nah, what's wrong with a horse? That was a huge bet he made, and it worked. I do love email. Wherever possible, I try to communicate asynchronously. I'm really good at email. Tesla is here to stay and keep fighting for the electric car revolution.